Okay, so Pat, what would you do if you had a, a patient with a difficult airway? Okay, so we have a number of devices that we can use. Um, the one that I find most useful is what we call the CMAP, which is a type of video that we use So what we use here is the, the, the ringoscope handle that looks very similar to the one that I showed you previously, but it gives us a much better view of the patient's airway and it enables everyone in the theatre to be able to see it too, so your assistant can see it and can help you with um, providing like, um, different positions where you can visualise your vocal cords a lot easier to put, put your breathing tube down. Um, we also use it, so we use it for when like patients do have very difficult airways where it's difficult to put the breathing tube in. But we also use it um, if for some reason um, the patient has neck issues where we don't want to hyperextend their neck at all, um, we can use it and we can maintain the patient's neck in just a very neutral position. Um, which is yeah, really handy in some cases. We can also use it if for some reason the patient's got very difficult dental work as well or like abnormal dentition. Um, because everyone can see what's happening in the airway, it just means that we yeah, can minimise the damage of, to teeth by using it as well. Um, and yeah, it's good in, in patients who may not have a difficult airway but we just want everything to go in a lot smoother because they may have obstructive sleeping apnea or they may be large and we just want to have everything on our side so that yeah we get a, a good view and get the breathing tube in without getting up and around. Very worthy. Yeah. 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 Yeah